We've had some time to think about your little betrayal yesterday. We're not mad. We get it. When people get too close to you, you run away. We made you a place to sit. I don't like that. And actually, if you guys don't snap out of this right now, I'm giving you all Fs. The illustrious one says that grades just tear us apart. The grades also get you into Harvard. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to Harvard. No, I'm staying here and having Marcus's babies. And that'll do her. Uh, I'm out. Ah. All right. It's curious you're trying to break up our little family, Jack. Especially considering the fact that you're from a broken home yourself. Your father. Where is your father, Jack? I honestly don't care. Let's restart. Good morning. Where is Papa, Jack? Is Papa mad? Nope. Joke's on you. Sends me a Christmas card every year from Ann Arbor. Tell Anthony about the last time you saw your papa. Let me inhale your pain. I'm strong enough. Okay, but my dad didn't care about me when I was young, and I don't care about him now that he's old. It's too much. It's too much. Good morning. Good morning, illustrious one. <laughs> <laughs> what an odd joke. Me, the illustrious one. The illustrious one speaks to us through Victor. Every Wednesday at 5.30. That lady? Is that your therapist? More importantly, she's our leader. We must help Jack reconcile with his father. I found his father's address and drafted a letter from Jack. He forgives his father and beckons him home. Uh, well, let's definitely not send that letter. <laughs> um, brothers and sisters. Sarika is wise. Let us dance.